हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल साइड एंडल ब्लॉग सो आई एम डॉक्टर अभिषेक वर्किंग एज लीडर इन डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ ओरल मेडिसिन एंड एडोलॉजी इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ डेंटल साइंसेस भुवनेश्वर सो एंड इफ यू हैव नॉट फॉलोड मी इन इंस्टाग्राम प्लीज डू फॉलो मी इन इंस्टाग्राम एट साइड डेंटल ब्लॉग्स सो टुडे माय टॉपिक विल बी हाउ टू बी अ गुड डेंटिस्ट एंड हाउ टू बी रिनोड इन योर प्रैक्टिस एंड हाउ टू हैव फेम एंड प्रॉस्पेरिटी इन योर लाइफ so yes today's topic i was thinking for a long time that i'll make this kind of video so there are two three aspects about this so we'll have a discussion and i'll let you know it's not much uh, of knowledge but yes you have to inculcate these things in your practice and also in your life so first thing what i would like to tell you in order to be a good dentist first you have to whenever the patient comes to your clinic you have to show empathy you have to show some kindness to the patient you have to talk to the patient as a nahi hai ki you just patient just comes and you make the patient sit and start doing the treatment so first of all you have to take the history of the patient very properly you have to ask the patient about its habits about his lifestyle where does he stay where does he work and these all things will help in building a rapport with the patient and the patient first has to develop a trust in you then only he will टू एनी काइंड ऑफ ट्रीटमेंट ऑन यू राइट जब तक इंसान का ट्रस्ट आपके ऊपर नहीं आएगा तब तक वो क्यों आपके दांत के काम आपके आपसे करवाएगा राइट सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू नीड टू डेवलप रेपो विद पेशेंट एंड बी वेरी काइंड एंड पोलाइट विद पेशेंट एंड मेक द थिंग्स अंडरस्टैंड इन अ वेरी कूल वे सो एंड ऐसा नहीं कि अब बस यू जस्ट कीप ऑन वर्किंग लाइक एन एस एंड यू जस्ट डू एवरीथिंग यू जस्ट वर्क कामली एंड वेरी कूलली ऑन द पेशेंट इफ द पेशेंट इज केयर यू हैव टू टेल द पेशेंट टू बी वेरी मच relaxed and you have to tell the patient that to loosen the body and just you can do after that you can make the patient understand and the patient relatives also that this is not a very big procedure it's not a painful procedure it will be totally painless so this way you can treat the patient very nicely plus there is a very big moral responsibility in our life in our clinics towards the patient of telling the truth to the patient whatever is Uh, whatever problem is there with the patient for example i am just giving you one example for example if you uh, one file is broke uh, in the canal and uh, a file breaks and uh, you should tell the patient ki this this has happened we need to either do the retreatment or do the extraction of the teeth because if the patient comes to know later then it will be like a loss of trust and patient won't be able to trust you anyhow or any dentist in the near future so this is a very important thing which i feel you should do in the practice for example a tooth is broken while extraction so you have to tell the patient that the tooth is broken right so it will take some time to remove it or you have to call some consultant to remove it but there is no harm in telling that the tooth is broken patient won't feel bad yes initially the initial moment the patient will give uh, like he will give a scary kind of reaction or he may get or he she may get angry over you ki that you have done a mistake but it's it's a human error right we cannot be perfect always so whenever the patient uh, tells you okay then initially he will tell you he will scold you he may tell you that why you have not uh, done it properly and so at that time you tell the patient that some cases are complicated and it needs special attention and i have to call a consultant which can, after that you will be all right so patient will be also cool and you are also cool so you have to develop that kind of trust if you don't tell the patient about the procedure you have done and you have done some mistake or you have done some extra work or you have to tell the patient and do it you should not like hide anything from the patient this is the thing because you are not the single dentist in india or anywhere else there are many other dentists and patient has to trust where if the patient gets transferred to other place he won't visit a dentist he said dentist log aise hote hain aise hote hain so kafi sada comments bhi aa rahe the mujhe kuch din pehle youtube pe ki dentist log lootte hain it's not like that you patients you have to develop the trust between you and the patient itself it's is very important and we have to stop blaming the other dentists like uh, if you say are usne to galat kaam kiya hai and this is this should be the way it should be done you should never try to blame any other dentist for the work because you don't know what is the history you don't know what is the uh, patient is saying correct 
you don't know about the tooth when the patient has come to you so you should never trust like whatever uh, you should take the radiograph and you should confirm it and this is the our duty our moral duty towards other fellow dentists that we should never talk about other people and we should be careful on our work right so this is the message which i wanted to deliver to you people ki be the patient whether rich or poor you have to be equal to everybody it's not like you should not tell the poor patient to keep the tooth or save the tooth by seeing his dress by seeing his dressing sense by seeing his color by seeing his religion no you have to be equal to everybody and you should do the same treatment suppose a patient comes to you then you should give the option of doing an rct or an extraction you yeah we know that the patient cannot pay who patient cannot pay 6 7000 for a rct and crown but still you have to give the option to the patient because you never know he must have saved something for his health he must have got some insurance he, he must have got some money saved for all the treatments for his health checkup so you should be equal to the patient that's what i wanted to say you and aisa nahi ki koi ameer aadmi aaya to usse bahut zyada charge kar liye be optimal be take the rate which is in your area and should not charge extra whatever is required you should charge you should tell the patient and do it initially so what i feel in my practice before starting the treatment i tell the patient we are going to do this we are going to do this we are going to do rct we are put, uh, going to put this crown and give options to the patient you should not do the treatment and tell the rain, tell the money initially you should tell the money okay i am going to do the scaling and it will cost approximately 1200 rupees or 800 rupees or 1000 whatever it is so after telling if the patient agrees do it otherwise don't because after doing if the patient doesn't pay you you will get annoyed the patient will get annoyed and it causes lot of disturbance and it causes lot of loss like loss of distrust lot of distrust is created between both the dentist and the patient so developing a rapport is very important and uh, so today i will end my video here and it's a short video and i have uploaded uploaded a video in abhishek pati vlogs go please check it out check it out in my channel abhishek pati vlogs so till then take care bye bye